Hey guys, and welcome back to the channel. It's Monet here. Y'all, I'm honestly so emotional this morning. Like, as you can tell by the title of this vlog, we're going to fucking close on the house. And by the time you guys are seeing this vlog, I'll pretty much be moved out of my apartment. So it's giving me chills. And honestly, like, I've been avoiding this like feeling, I feel like, for this whole process. It hasn't really felt real till now. My mom's on her way up. Um, I'm actually still in New York. If you guys saw my chaotic weekend last weekend on TikTok and Instagram, last minute came to New York to see Drake. So that was on Friday. We stayed Saturday. And then closing was on Monday. So I was like, I might as well just stay one more night and then just go to my new place, which is closer to the city than it is my old apartment. So here I am. I'm gonna go meet mom for the final walkthrough. <sighs> and y'all, I'm just so emotional. I have like a pit in my stomach. After we close, I'm just gonna go back to the apartment though. And then just hang out tonight. Probably play some Fortnite. Just really enjoy it one last night. Ugh, it makes me sick speaking out loud about it. It does, it really does, it really genuinely does. <laughs> oh my gosh. So I'm excited for the final walkthrough. It's gonna be really fun to see. I don't know what this closing process looks like, but we gonna be signing some papers, we're gonna get the keys, and then I'll drive home with mom. So I think I might film for TikTok right now and I'll insert it and then we'll be on the way. We'll get some coffee and then let's go see the final walkthrough. So <sighs> this vlog's gonna be a journey, y'all. This vlog's gonna be a journey. This week is gonna be, I'm sure there's gonna be some more tears. Cause last week's video, we were crying too. Just a very emotional season. So, and thank you for all the love on the last week's video. Like y'all know I was in the comments, like so soft. So I love you. Thank you for being here on this journey with me. And y'all let's get this vlog. I can't even say it. I know this is supposed to be such an exciting day, but like I'm so emotionally shocked right now. I just can't believe closing my house finally. It just doesn't feel real. I literally have no words. You know what? Let's just focus on the makeup in front of us. Cause this is the color corrector in peach. I got so many questions on this cause it's so bomb. It's so brightening. I need that today cause I want to look like a corpse. So it happened really fast. I have been meaning to move closer to New York. My mom recently really hit the floor running with her real estate. So she sent me over some places to look at. We toured a place on our first open house date and dad has put an offer in before we left. I'm a type of person like when I know like I don't even like to question things I'm just like this this is it we looked around at some other places just to say we did we ended up going with my first choice and if you guys did watch my video of the houses it was the third one but I think right now the shock is that I'm not gonna be able to call like my home that's all I've known my whole life it's just not my home anymore I think that's the part that's really just like I cannot I, I can't even be excited for the new move yet because I haven't really processed that I'm leaving my like childhood home I'm gonna be so sad he has such a good lip liner color, Travis. And I love his refined like lip tints. Are you guys ready? <laughs> We're about to go do a final walkthrough and then sign the papers. This does not feel real. Let's go meet my mom and let's go close in my house. Why is when you're a baby, you know? <laughs> I'm emotional too. This is home. Oh my god, it's so bald. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what? Sorry, I fully walked past it. I feel nauseous. Maybe the car ride, like everything. I'm just like. Y'all, this is just so random. Like, when you put on a little spotlight there, it's gonna be beautiful. It's gonna dazzle. <laughs> I just like, even the symmetry of it, like, why is it next to the fireplace like that? Just in the corner. I don't know. I just don't understand. There's plant there, you can accent, accent it. It's just not my vibe. <clears throat> okay, this is basically an empty house tour, guys. Starting from the top. Look, y'all, we get some cool champagne in here. That was four. Yeah. Beverage cooler, wine 
I guess this is for wine too, right? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna stop that hoe. <laughs> I'll make sure you got all flavors. The rooftop, gorgeous. <laughs> yeah, me too. I was gonna do like black, just like all black. Mm -hmm. I found a really nice rug that was like that brown color and black, and it was like stripes, and I was obsessed with it. But then I think it made sense because like there was no brown, but I, I'm like that could literally tie it in. Yeah. I will have a neighbor though, a rooftop neighbor. You can make privacy. You can get like those. Um, oh, I'll get some plants. Rose fences and stuff. Yeah. You can light it up here. I was definitely thinking some shrubs over here. Oh, I'm just gonna shrub the whole thing. Yeah. I'm just gonna shrub the whole fucking thing. Yeah. So it just feels like a on little the oasis. Outside and here, get the fence. Yeah. The yeah. That's a good idea because this is basically my neighbor. I'm gonna just shrub it. Ooh. Yeah. And then so we don't have to see like this action too. Yeah. Cool. Oh my god, I was talking to Nancy yesterday and she was like, please tell me she went with house three. And yeah. I was like, mm -hmm. we did. And it's closing freaking morning. This is the final walkthrough. <gasps> How cute, our little office. Everything's nice and cool. Oh my god, I finally get a, is yeah. this have ice? Does this have ice? <gasps> Fresh ice and cute Crushed ice, bro. That is some elite luxury living. So what's this? This is my house mom. I need to know all these little random, I've never considered what this is in my life. Use box. So if you need to like change lighting or something like that, you can manually go in and turn off the power to it. Oh, no. Okay. This is a nice little space. It's probably like my glam room. Something like that. Yes, fan. Period. That is good. That is quiet. This is the. This is a pretty big bathroom for being like not the main one. Yeah. It's huge. It's beautiful. Y'all know in the apartment now we literally have one square foot for our bathroom. So this is definitely an upgrade. What's up with the little things up here? What is it? What is it? The style. It's the lighting. Ooh. Which one would be my beauty room? Maybe this one because it's closer to my room. They have the same, it's basically the same thing. I feel nauseous. Dead ass. Got a little balcony. My room. Good mornings. We're gonna have our coffee and shit. Here's my closet. God damn. What is this though? That's for your vacuum. My vacuum? You plug it into, it's a vacuum hose and you plug it into the wall mm -hmm. and you can get the whole house. Like you don't have an actual vacuum. Alana was telling me I should go crazy in my closet. She was like, you should have someone just build you yeah. like a crazy thing. So like I have my shoes. She was like, if I see your shoes lying on the bottom of your floor, I was like, what? Yeah. But I'm like, honestly, you definitely need more hanger space. Well, yeah, there's literally no rods besides yeah. these two. Absolutely not. Y'all see how I rock at the crib right now. Yeah. Loki mentioned an interior designer in my last video. So if you guys recommend anyone on the East Coast that wants to help me out, let me know. Send me over their Instagrams. That's like the best way I can like Bye. check stuff out. <gasps> Damn, I forgot I have a bathroom in my room. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> okay, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna enjoy the empty house tour, basically. <gasps> Next up, we're gonna go sign, whatever that looks like. Yeah. I'm scared, let's go. Uh, Fake it till you make it. Right. Damn. God. <laughs> <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> They're effing homeowner. That's iconic. Oh my gosh, y'all. Hi. <laughs> we closed on the house. We closed on the house. Let me grab my keys. That's a that's a nice little ring. <gasps> Stop. Look what mom got me too. Mother effing homeowner. Like, period. Y'all, let me just tell you how yesterday went because honestly, I didn't even vlog. Yesterday was honestly super intense. Y'all saw like I was having lots of emotions going through that whole process, like touring the house. And then um closing took, I was signing for like 30 minutes straight. That I was like my hand was cramping. <laughs> but it was really special to like spend that with mom and like close together and honestly it was like way less 
it was like really anticlimactic. Like I thought it was gonna be a moment where it's like, you hand the keys across the table and it's like, this is your last paper to sign. Like you did it, like this is your property, woo. Like no, it did not happen like that. <laughs> um, and honestly talking all those numbers, like all the, I was literally signing away my life, which was really interesting. Talk a mortgage, like I got a mortgage payment, girl. Like that's what my I'm paying mortgage. That's crazy. So yeah, once so we had a two-hour drive to get home yesterday, and after that, I just was like, you know, I think I'm just gonna enjoy the apartment. Just a rot away day. I'm gonna miss those days. Like, fuck. I really just absorbed my house. Like, damn, this is like home. Like, this is home, and I'm not really gonna have that for a while. I realized, like. So this is a really exciting chapter, but yeah. So I basically just laid around yesterday, ate Chipotle, played Fortnite, like that is like peak form for me. Like I love that. I love that. Played with all my siblings and Buki. Like it was a fun ass night. We were all in, like in the chat just like, oh me, oh me, oh me, oh me. Basically now I'm just coordinating movers to come and just one truck for donation, one truck for moving to the new place. So mom is gonna come over, Ari's gonna come over to help, Boogie's coming over to help, like kind of just sort through everything. I'm trying to figure out how to make this the most seamless process because I haven't really started yet and it's Tuesday and I'm trying to move on by Friday. Like Thursday and Friday, I want like donation on Thursday, moving on Friday. <sighs> So I'm like, I should start with like my clothes. I should start, I should start like room by room. That's what I realized was probably the best idea. Oh my gosh, there's so many closets. Like me and mom are really gonna have to sit down and go through everything. Cause there's so much of our like, just that's all our possessions. That's literally all of our possessions of my entire life are in this house. Like random ass shit. I'm excited to go through like my baby scrap scrapbooks though. Buckle up, cause there's gonna be a lot of time lapses I feel like this video and just like literally moving out the apartment. I'm honestly not ready. Like it's gonna be a sad moment, like taking down my Christmas lights and like taking the shit off my walls. Like, oh, it's gonna fucking kill me. I'm sad, <sighs> but it's time girls. So I'm heading over to mom's right now. I just went to Whole Foods. I went to the gym. You can tell I look like a sweaty mess. We're gonna hang with mom and Cashew for a little bit. Let's go see granny. Yeah. And then there was a man with something like this, right? Oh, a stroller. Mm -hmm. But a big one. A this huge. is hard. I don't know how to do this part. No, it's 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 hard. Let, let me put it. Did you do it? Yeah. <gasps> Who's that, got a stroller? That almost caught your fingers. Who's you know, got it's... a stroller? Who's a big baby? Who's a big baby? Oh, you don't cut. I just think about it. Yo, Cashew gained one pound. He's a big man, and he's losing a lot of teeth. Oh! <gasps> <laughs> hey, vlog. Hi. <laughs> We're gonna take him on a stroller walk? Yeah. His first little walk? His first stroll. Money is like this. <gasps> I cannot. <laughs> Let's see if he likes it. How how is this? How long is it? <laughs> I know he's gonna. I know he loves it. You gotta give him a blankie. <gasps> Look a how toy. cute! Oh, I understand. Yay! Yay! Hold on, Gabriel. Damn! Oh, how this got him? I got him. We should go on a stroll. Where is he? <laughs> It's a <laughs> that is so cute. <laughs> That's Big Sister's welcome so gift. My goodness. Ah, uh, you have to put this. Not the grannies have a whole new baby though. <laughs> Dead ass. Let's take a walk. I think. Let's take a walk. Oh, so he can't jump out. That's smart. Okay, so maybe he can just like stick his head out, but he won't jump. Yay! God, you got a stroller. And there's two leashes in there, so he can't jump out, which is really good. And I got it on Amazon. This is Big Sister's second gift. <laughs> Cash, you like it? Look, he's trying to jump out. Yeah, he's trying. You got a seatbelt on. Hey, vlog. We're home and we're starting the process. Yes, this is like overwhelming. Crazy. This is why I haven't started yet. I'm just waiting for 
Mom to come and Gabriel is here. Cashew's here. I'm scared because there's so much shit everywhere. So Cashew's here helping, supporting, but we have so much to go through. Look at this. So like all of this, like, yo, this this in itself is gonna take 20 minutes, you know? Bookshelf, I'm just clearing out shit. I probably will bring see, it back. I do shit quick, babe. Okay, let's see. <laughs> I'd be like, let's see, Granny. Or in a bag. So yeah, we have so much, like all these vases and stuff, but mom snapped with grabbing the supplies. Thank you so much, mom. Awesome. Yeah, cause we needed all this. We got bags, trash bags, glass dividers, tape, shrink wrap type thing, all the boxes to pack. Like I need you to take whatever you want to take and then the rest I'll start packing away. Okay, sounds good. Lord. Okay, now we're going through our vases, see which ones we're gonna keep. Gabriel's gonna be on bubble wrapping duty. Oh, this is kinda of fun. Yeah. Aww. Oh, babe. I'm not as sad for this move. Yeah. Versus the last one where I was sad. What, the blue house? But just me moving the condo. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Yes, we got bubble wrap. Are you guys kidding y'all? Whatever you don't take, I'll look. We'll take her. Yeah, that one's pretty. I'll probably take like four. Maybe like that one. You got that one? Yeah, I think just that one. Which one? Yep. That's it for me. I'm gonna get just new, like funky ones. Like, yeah. you know, like cool shaped vases. Yeah. Yeah. But at least have a few to start. Right, you like mom, that mom can have that. You can have that. Huh? You guys can take it. Those, those will be mine. You like that one? Yeah, flowers. Well, I was gonna take these two. Yay. Ha <laughs> ha! <Morning. laughs> yes. Come on, girls. Yeah. Uh, how do you do this? Period. I am a little bit nervous. Woo! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just uh, make that make the turn a little bit wider. You know, you know that, right? Yeah, I drove some trucks before. Ah, yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Like we did much, but most of the and cabinets. And that closet had like this closet. a bazillion things. It I mean, still has. you guys have seen this one before, but look how bare it is. <gasps> no clothes. All the clothes are in here. Um, and we like kind of cleared the shelves. All I'm gonna say is we still have a long, long way to go. So we're done for tonight, but mom's gonna come over twice tomorrow. I'm gonna put in the work during the day, and then we still have we have until Friday 1 p.m. To move out and it's Tuesday so we got time we're gonna be hustling good night hey guys it's Wednesday um, still sorting through makeup products keep go hair stuff skincare trying to make everything organized and trying to move with literally just one large box of each for myself one hair product box which we which we did this is all hair 
And then this will be one thing of makeup. So this is what we're looking like. This is my skincare one popping off so far. And so far these two are to donate. So it's been tough. Y'all, I'm not even going to lie. I'm really grateful that Mom and Gabriel came over yesterday and helped the way they did because doing this alone is just like depressing and then also just like finding the motivation i'm just like so overwhelmed where do i start and i'm really not trying to walk things down up and down the stairs by myself because i'm just like one trip i'm making some progress though i'm filling bags lots of trash to take out but we did empty out the whole entire hair closet emptied out the whole pantry closet emptied out the whole front closet so you know we're tackling the very heavy places Tackling under this, under here is always the biggest. But my closet and then my room, my room is really gonna take the longest, of course. It's just more so the makeup and just like what I wanna keep and what I need to go. Cause I don't use a lot of this stuff and I don't wanna bring anything unnecessary. So the bathroom would be really quick. And then mom's room is like, I mean, it's a pretty small apartment. This is all we got. We definitely made it work. We stuffed the corners. So I figured I'd give you guys an update. This will probably be the only one for today. I'll probably check in maybe tonight and just see where we're at, but this is what it's giving. This is what it's giving. Okay, bye. I got presentable today with my little pony and seal, put a little outfit on, and look who I have. Where's my hype man? Hey, girl. Oh, I'm talking about you. Oh. Uh. <laughs> my hype woman, too. Hi. Hey, queen. Y'all, we're here to put in work this morning, so I made a walkway for mom. She had one specific request. Yeah. She made me be fucking ready this morning, because she's not here to play games. So, yeah, this is my makeup bin so far. I'm going to leave these open, because they're not full yet. But donate and then skincare. So like I said, this is what we're working with. Hi, Cashew. You're such a good boy. You do <laughs> Yo, when I saw mom come in this morning with him in her little bag, I was so hyped. Because my man, my little man. <gasps> my little man. <laughs> ah, ah. He likes to bite faces. He likes to jump and bite on a face. No jumping. No jumping on my face. And he also thinks the rug in my room is a pissy pad. And he takes his boo-boos on my rug. But I'm like, good thing we're leaving. <laughs> Hi, my stinky. <laughs> like what? How about we stay right here? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> you want to play? You want to get fucked up so bad. He's literally a teddy bear. He's literally a teddy bear, you guys. He sits like a little teddy bear. Look. <laughs> okay, so it's time to get back to work. Let me show you guys my closet because these are basically all the boxes from my closet. Holy shit, I was not expecting that many clothes. But I basically like did a big purge not too long ago. Guys, look. It's fucking empty. It's fucking empty. Isn't that crazy? All my shoes. So yeah, my job today is to pack up my room. Because they're coming tomorrow at 1 p.m. So, so yeah. We're just about to get to work. Sister, this is just my clothes. 
Sis, this is just my clothes. That's not even all of it. Hey, vlog. I'm down bad, honestly. I really am. I don't know if you can hear, I'm sick. I feel like shit. Um, it's 9 p.m. This was a 13 hour, 13 hour moving day. It's Thursday. Um, I just had a good little cry sesh. I wanted to vlog more today, but I feel like a lot of the moments I wanted to just like soak up. And honestly, I can feel myself just avoiding. Oh my God, my nose sound, I sound really congested right now. <laughs> I'm just stuffed the fuck up. I don't know, there's so many like memories and mementos that I was just like, I don't even want to get into it. This is just super like emotional in so many ways. And I think that it's just interesting seeing how like everything's kind of playing out. I can't even open my eyes right now. My eyes are so fucking itchy. Oh my God, yo. I feel like this is a very low low for me right now. <laughs> and I know like next week it'll be a different story and the week after it'll be a different story. I know just right now, the stars are not fucking aligning. Honestly, I feel so alone, which I haven't really felt in a while. I just feel like it's such a big moment for me and I know like everyone has their own lives going on but at the end of the day like I'm just feeling really alone I'm just feeling like empty a little bit I look a mess I don't know what's wrong I think I need to go to sleep though this morning started off great almost done emptying everything out but I'm about to take those mel melatonin like the lemmy sleep gummies like their melatonin and like chamomile bro that shit had me floating last night like I literally felt like I was on edible <laughs> it didn't knock me out I was like eerie was such a good sleep so i think i might just take them right now and go the fuck to bed so i'll, I'll check it in the morning it'll be better vibes and the movers are coming so we gotta load this shit and i'll give you an update in the morning so get some z's girls see you then good morning guys i'm feeling better holy shit um literally i woke up at 3 a.m for the past like three nights just like wide awake i think my body knows that i'm leaving i think like just a lot of mental I'm emotionally going through a lot like moving is a fucking lot moving is not for the week and you know moving can happen in a day but packing I should have like started weeks ago because this has been so intense trying to cram this in like this week but look y'all she's packing like I'm saving my room decorations for last because I feel like that's gonna make me cry but um look at the progress it doesn't give <laughs> It doesn't give a lot of progress, but I promise. We the the U-Haul is full. How you feel, mom? Yeah, I'm sore. Like three days of up and down, loading these boxes in a truck. Yeah, I do gotta give props to mom because she's doing the stair work. Yeah, I've been heavy lifting. Yeah, I've just been like, mm, let me take this box. Sorting. Yeah, but that gives me my brain is sore. Yeah. <laughs> my brain is sore. But the movers called two hours early and they're like, you ready? I was like, are you? He's like, yeah, I'll be in 30 minutes. So we're kind of not scrambling because I mean, pretty much everything's outside in the truck. But yeah, girl, she's just there. Hi, Shana. Mom's bestie's helping us. So sweet. We need all the hands we can get. So just figured I'd give you guys an update. Let's go pack the truck. Empty. 
Don't make me cry. Come on, got a joke in the box. Yeah. And these were like just funny memories. Like, remember we were like, let's write things that make us laugh. I remember there was this one day, like someone made a joke about like pancakes or something, and I was in middle school. And I thought it was the funniest thing ever. <laughs> and we wrote a, I, it's in here. I thought we wrote a first one. one. I'm scared. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. We went to give all the poor people food, and we had to tell them to not grab more than what they were supposed to. <laughs> and I had to tell someone, and I was so scared. And then we went out for Mexican food after. That was so fun. That's really cute. I think we um we went to the soup kitchen, the Philadelphia one, right? Not well, it was Philip Abundance. That's what it was. And they were at Linda Wall train station. And I wanted to teach the girls like to volunteer and stuff. Oh, these are cute, Wall. Yeah. Let's see. And uh, they were trying. I said, remember when we were in Six Flags waiting to go on a ride, and we were seeing who can balance on their tippy toes the longest, and you were literally putting all your weight on my on your toes, and your whole body was forward. Like, what? <laughs> <laughs> these are really cute. Yeah. I think I'll keep these. I love that. Me and mommy memories. Yeah. Oh, this one's so good too. Now look, the room is bare. <laughs> I didn't cry. Honestly, since we do have this spot until like end of August and I have a feeling that I'm probably gonna sleep at mom's tonight because <sighs> I don't really want to sleep in the new place by myself yeah I think I'm gonna just sleep at granny's tonight and like drive up there drive back here we have Beyonce on Sunday so I think this vlog might come a little bit later because I mean this has just been a lot um but I want to give you the moving tea so yeah, I'm not like so sad that when I close the doors, it's gonna be the last time I'm ever walking in here again. We definitely have to clean before we like leave, leave. We can't just give them dusty, dirty floors and like all this shit, so. I mean, that's what it's really giving right now. But look, I took everything off the walls. I'm gonna leave the bed here. I do have new mattresses going to the new place, so I will leave this just in case I do need to crash here. Um, I will take this TV off eventually, but I'm glad that I have that extra time. And y'all, not two girls waiting outside. <laughs> Literally like, I've been inside just packing and stuff and the mover came up and was like basically just asking like Chanel said they drove up they just left them at in a jeep oh my gosh so they drove up and they were hanging so. around yeah. like waiting for me like a Monet spotting kind of like, vibe we appreciate the love but just a little bit of boundary yeah I think this is like a super vulnerable just like intense moment in my life yeah. and they kind of just were like waiting outside to like see me so that was kind of crazy um but hey if you're watching the youtube hey girl hey girl hey we can live in the comments sometimes we're like you know <laughs> love you i'm already paranoid enough i'm hoping that my next place is more just like private and you know also while we're here i might as well just tell you guys that someone else also left a note on my front door which is another encounter which freaked me out just a little bit because i'm just like you know, I, you know where I stay. Like, knowing where I stay is, like, so scary to me. Like, ugh. The note was very nice. Yeah, Mom. Ex exactly. Exactly. But we got to emphasize that it was very nice, very sweet, kind note. But I think, yeah. Kind of just, how do I even say that without, I don't want to come off, like, yeah, I feel like it was just a boundary of just, like, leaving a note on my front door. But, hey, if that was you that left a note. Um, so, anyway. The living room is like, look y'all, the couch is gone. The kitchen table's gone. Like what the fuck? I'm honestly really excited now. I'm at the point where it's like, I'm hyped to get out of here and like not be around all this dust and dirt. Goddamn. Cool girl. We're in the U-Haul. Hauling all this ass. It's hey. <sighs> Holy fuck. Y'all, we're in the new spot, if you can't tell. It feels so like home. S like, I felt this way right when I, when I saw it for the first time. And like right now I'm like, I'm moving into my house. Like that's what it feels like and I'm so happy that's the case because 
I don't know, a lot of the times, like, it just doesn't go that way. I'm really out of breath because two flights of stairs. <sighs> I remember like watching Aaliyah's, Aaliyah's vlogs. She was talking about how stairs were a bitch and I was like, I don't know, I've only ever had one flight of stairs so I think she has like five. <laughs> so just like, I feel like I get it just with even two. I have three total, but I'm not going up, I'm not going up the third one. I'm sweating. I just checked the AC, which is like, first of all, y'all, I got a fucking AC. And I'm so curious to see how it's gonna work because I've never had like an in-house like AC unit. I just had like a direct, usually my room, my rooms are just so small that when you have the door closed and you have one AC in it, it cools, it's an icebox. So I'm curious to see how this AC cools out this whole unit. It's actually five o'clock right now. I left my house at three. So that's literally how far the commute is. So I really thought I was gonna go back home tonight. I don't think so. I'm so tired, y'all, and I'm so sick. And my body actually is like giving out. So just taking, up, taking that heavy ass box up those stairs, I almost didn't make it. I really almost dropped it. I'm so happy right now. Not as sad as I thought it was gonna be. I think I was so ready to be done packing that like I gave mama a hug. I was like, love you, bye. She was like, bye girl. Like, we only snapped each other once at the end, and it was, we both were just over it, so. <sighs> Taj is actually on the way to come help me. The movers are like an hour away still, so. The only thing here is I don't have Wi-Fi. So in the meantime, like before they get here, oh my God, the AC is, I feel it, I feel it. I'm so excited. In the meantime, I think I'm gonna try to run to like Verizon and get like a hotspot. <laughs> my gosh, oh, I can't believe my house i'm actually really excited to be here i'm so excited to be here i'm so happy i don't think i'm sad like at all which is so good i really felt so uneasy i just felt so weird i didn't really know how to feel all day today so the fact that i'm happy right now is making me really happy i'm gonna put the champagne in the fridge thank you mom this is how the kitchen vlogs are this is how the vlogs are going now y'all like this is my kitchen bro okay i have my little freaking hug thing Oh, it says welcome home. And this little video looks like cashew. I literally miss that dog. I was so sad mom didn't bring him today. Look, welcome home. This is so cool. So the thing is right now I don't have anything, like nothing. There's not one seat or one couch or anything in the house. So I'm just gonna stand. Oh my God. This is my house, y'all. This is my house, y'all. Oh, this is so, like this is my room. This is my bedroom. What? Oh my God, bitch. And I got a ceiling fan. And y'all honestly got me sketched, like I'm not gonna show outside my windows cause they're so bald right now. I got a fan, girl. That's so cool. I got a ceiling fan, never had one of those. I'm gonna just put all the fans on. So cool. I'm just beaming right now. And I have a pantry. I walk past this pantry like every time it doesn't register. This is a motherfucking pantry, dude. And like I put a broom right there and shit. That's so cool. This is amazing, y'all. I'm actually really, I'm really happy right now. Yo. Look who's here, vlog. Hey, vlog. A big muscle man. Hi, T. Hello. We're being good hostesses right now, opening the glasses, you know, giving them some water. Yeah. Are these new? Um, no. We're gonna get real new stuff, huh? Yes. We're gonna get new stuff, huh? Let's start, I'm gonna start putting them in here. This is your new home. Yeah, it is. What's that? Ice water? What's, what's that? What's, this is water. It's just water. It's water. It, it ain't no not, from, not from the top? No, no he's so bougie. 
Goodbye. You're so bougie. Some cups over here. Yeah. Some is the wrong one. Yeah. <laughs> I asked you, you said. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Alright. When you're ready for the Jamaican food, they can call me. But yeah. it is very far, but I could cook up a pot for you. Oh, that's sweet. Can you see these little wine glasses? I love them. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. Don't okay. Yeah, this. Yeah. One of the that huh? I don't think that. What's your name? Taj. Taj? Like the Taj Mahal. Alright. <laughs> so, we got to want my hand, two of your hands, two of your hands, and the glass. We have a big glass there. Okay. So, you know, coming up the stairs. I got you. You doing it now? No, not yet. Okay. I can help too. I can help too. Cause that, yeah. Is that the mirror? Yeah. And honestly, I was playing my own little time. I was like, God, this is so heavy. Is it heavy? It's heavy. It's going in here? When you take it, it's so big that you take a selfie and you can't even see the mirror. Whoa, you need it, huh? That's what I was just saying. I'm like, we need to figure out where this big ass mirror is going to go. I think, like, honestly, I feel like that's. Right here, because with the bars in the back on the pictures. Yeah. And like, Everyone can have a moment in it. That's what I'm saying. Like, like I don't want to put it in my room. You can probably oh. get like another. You put it there, but you can put it there. You got a laptop, a plug. Nah. So the plug. Nah. The plug. And I think the stairs. Like it's too much over there with the stairs. I think it's it's big enough. It needs its moment, like here. Yeah. All right. But it's gonna have to go like away from here. Yeah. No, right here. Yeah. Right there would be perfect. Is that motherfucking big? Taj. Why is that so? It's it's, no, it's it's even bigger. I'm just. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> keep my hands off again. It's gorgeous. Like that was my. I was like, this is a lifetime mirror. Like I'm gonna buy this because in every single house, it's gonna find a room. <laughs> Holy shit! I told you, Taj. I don't, I don't even want to see it fully. I'm going to put it just in here. You don't get to wait. <gasps> oh, right, go ahead. I was falling. All right. What's the right? What's the right? What's the right? Good morning, morning, morning. Good morning, vlog. Good morning, vlog. I'm alive. I didn't even get to check in last night because I wish you could have seen how down bad I was. I can't believe I'm sick through all this. My body's actually like decaying right now. So I'm about to go lay down. <laughs> Before I do, I wanted to show you. This is what it's looking like right now. Oh my gosh, look, we got some shaking. This unboxing has been my life. Just trying to find places for things. Look, the little vanity made it. Eee! My room, I need to get curtains, but we have a little air mattress right now. I'm so excited to lay down. My body is hurting so bad. I'm about to start editing this vlog for you guys. Ideally, I want to have it. Oh, <sighs> you guys. Oh, okay. Ideally, I have this vlog to you guys on Sunday, which is tomorrow. I also have Beyonce. I also don't have an outfit. It's a very big moment in my womanhood. I'm just like, damn, y'all. This is just a, such a big moment. I feel like everyone's moving right now. Comment down below if you're moving soon or now or have you guys ever done a big move like this before? Like, this is my first one. I never dormed in college. I never moved out type shit. No, this is a big moment. And I honestly, I'm super glad this feels like home because it's so like, mm, I love it. I'm, I'm dying, guys. But I love you. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for moving with me. On to new beginnings. Thank you for all the love and supporting me through everything and the apartment i'm gonna miss her she really was a vibe i'm glad we got to document it and share it i look so bad like honestly i feel like i i'm purging my life is just purging right now including my skin and sickness and all of this i feel like it's a sign but anyway love you <laughs>